Italy especially, but also in many other countries all around the world, impact tremendously society in terms of damage and potential loss of life. Due to climate change, uh, heavy rainstorms are expected to become very frequent with a significant amount of debris that can be mobilized along these slopes. So we are testing this interaction of flow like landslides with protection barriers. The Flow Impact Modeling Project has the mission to study the flow and the impact of fluidized masses on rigid and deformable barriers. Once flow like landslides occur, running at 10 meters per second, a couple of meters thick, it's possible to measure speed, mechanical properties of this material. In our laboratory, although sophisticated, we have different field conditions. The idea is to reproduce this high velocity in the material, and centrifuge is a unique facility to, to reproduce very nicely this kind of program. The Geo Centrifuge is one of our research facilities within Deltaris, and we use it for uh, scaling down real-sized models a certain amount of scale, and that certain amount of scale is dependent on uh, which G-force the researchers want to uh, apply on it. The Geocentrifuge is a facility that allows us to increase the acceleration from 1G to 150G and therefore it allows us to, to study problems that are large scale, so big problems, into a small domain. In this test we are releasing a mass of saturated soil flowing down over a slope and then impacting a barrier. This barrier can be either rigid and fixed to the ground or can be deformable and free to slide. So we are comparing a traditional solution with the new one. The second one is thin deformable barrier with low carbon footprint, no need for foundation, and so even much more cheap. The expected results uh, from the film project are the temporal trend of total stress and uh, pore water pressures together with the images acquired uh, during the flow motion can uh, provide an overall description of the dynamics of the impact problems and also we will provide suggestions for updating the design criteria of the protection barriers. Population are asking for safety, but all the time are protesting from the protection works proposed. Because they are ugly, they are grey, they are expensive, they are uh, polluting. So, a green option in our society is something uh, that could be much more accepted. Geolab is a project funded by the European Union and is a project that brings together different universities and research institutes and these universities and research institutes give access to their facilities, so to their laboratories and one example is Deltares and specifically we allow access to users in order to use our geocentrifuge. The Terrace in Geolab project specifically is making available a big centrifuge. It's a new one, wonderful one. But also the Terrace uh, developed a tool that will be used later on to simulate those experiments numerically. And in fact, before doing this test, we have been uh, promoting and developing research about numerical simulation of land and light structure interaction. So I'm very pleased adding this new chapter that is physical modeling testing inside the center.